Let us pray. Ask him to give you the grace. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Just give me the grace. Just give me the grace. To know you. To know you. To love you. To love you. To follow you. To follow you. Up to heaven. Up to heaven. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For dying. For dying. In my place. In my place. Amen. Amen. You're welcome. 1617 of Mark. And these signs will follow those who? Who? Who believe? And these signs will follow those who believe. In my name, they'll cast out demons. They will speak with new tongues. They'll take up serpents. And if they drink anything deadly, it will by no means hurt them. They will lay hands on the sick and they will recover. Say, I need power. I need power. That is why I'm here. Power to solve issues. There is power in the name of Jesus. You are a businessman. You need power in your office. Power not only to pastors. What if the witch doctors will come to your office with no power? No way. Leave her. Leave me. Leave me. I cannot leave you unless you leave her. Leave me alone. She is mine. She's yours. She's mine. I've sold her to Jesus. <laughs> and Jesus has paid his blood. Jesus has bought her with his blood. This is the blood of Jesus. This is the blood of Jesus. Go, because I've sold her to Jesus. Thanks be to Jesus Christ. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! There is power in the name of Jesus through the Holy Ghost. It is so great. In the name of Jesus. Through the Holy Ghost. It is so great. In the There is power. In the name of Jesus. Through the Holy Ghost. It is so great. There is power. In the name of Jesus. Through the Holy Ghost. It is so
Hallelujah. May be seated. My name is Prophet William. Oh, from Zambia. Zambia. Yes. Watch what is happening to the prophet from Zambia. Man of God, I want to ask something. From 2014 until now, it's been rough for my ministry since I got married. Well, God, what you're saying is true. I had a girlfriend like her just before I got married. And she said, <laughs> dare to leave me, you'll never have peace. She was like, I love you so much. And uh, you've decided to go with somebody else. She was very angry. And uh, she told me that I'll never have peace. So if you want to ask me a question, why you have not had peace with your beautiful wife, yeah, she is very beautiful. Have I answered the question? Yes, you have answered it. From where? Zambia. Thank you so much. In your capacity, go and get like $7,000. Okay. Don't go back to her because you are now married. Yes. Call her and say, please, whatever happened, me and you are over, but this $7,000. Go and start something. Okay, I'll do that. that. We have no issue. Thank you so but much. I'm sorry. I'll do that. Just to say, I'm sorry. Amen. Because you are the one who is suffering. Yes, yes, yeah? yes. Very much. You Ministry are the one to ask for forgiveness. Stuck. stuck everything People stuck. are leaving. The church is now small. Even like, when you pray, you dream that she is standing there. Yes. They say, God, you curse her. The curse is... Did yes. not work on her. Yeah. Because you were wrong. Come out, devil! Baby monk! Pick him. Part of God has touched this prophet from Zambia. Quarreling is the biggest problem. My name is Grisha Stungu. I'm coming from Lusaka, Zambia. Yes. What man of God has said is true. Uh, growing up, I've always had the spirit of anger. There's no big problem. You're not bad. Anger go in Jesus' holy name. Nelly Chewe. Um, I was born in Zambia, but I'm living in Germany. Man of God, I was feeling pain here. I, was, I told my neighbor. I looked at the man of God. I was crying. But I feel all my anxiety has gone away. By just looking at him, ask my mother. I told my mother, come to Kakandi. Kakandi will help me. At the time I just looked at you, I felt the happiness in me. I've gone in Germany. There are no churches which can heal me. I said, I told my father to my child, I want to go to Kakandi. Babe, give me the money. I want to go to Kakandi. He gave me, babe, go to Kakandi. If you believe, I say, babe, I believe he's going to heal me. And I just looked at you. Oh, the power was so much. Was so much as my neighbor. So what is happening to the lady? The flesh goes. People are there for years. They want to be delivered. That's a Because this is what is going on with you is an issue in the family. Because people run mad. My heart was pumping and then the doctor told me it's mental health. You have to take the medicine. And then the government want to take my children away. They say that if the children we take them away, you have to go to the hospital. I said, no, I refuse. I've been watching you and my daughter. My daughter is 12 years old. She said, mommy, go to Kakandi. We've seen this man. We watched you the whole night. And I, I felt peace. I didn't have peace. And the mental health in the family, and it's there. Another lady who looks exactly like you, she was mad. Yeah. Madness girl. <laughs> oh, oh. 
come back no more. You dream that people have come, they arrest you to take you, other they have no legs. What you have said it's true. I always dream people they are chasing me. People who doesn't have leg, they want like to arrest me. Who is this lady to you? <laughs> She's my mother. Yeah. I came with her. I got a flight for her. I said we meet at the airport, ma'am. She's Help from me. where? She's from Zambia. She's living in Zambia. I'm the only child. Special prayer being gone for the mom as well. How are you feeling now? I never had peace. I'm feeling peace. My mother can confirm this every time I call her on phone as if she doesn't care. Mom, I'm feeling pain. Mom, I don't have peace. But you are in Germany. You have everything. I said, Mom, I don't have peace. I'm going crazy. Mom, please help me. Go to any pastor. And then, what can I do? What can I do? Until I came to Kakandi and I'm free. Man of God, this is true. This heart, it's in Petauke to my grandmother. It's in the village where my grandmother used to live. My grandmother was a herbarist. Yes, yeah, she's the one that I look alike and ran mad. And ran what? Mad. <laughs> because all these were done at 13. It's true, when man of God. Years. Yes, when I was in the seventh, when I wrote my grade seven, my mother told me go for a holiday. I was 13 years old when I wrote my grade seven. And then I was reminding my mother in the room, in the hotel. I said, mom, remember you gave me the money. Say, go to your father's family. Go to your father's family. Go. That was my first time that I saw her. This is where it was like... A... The cloud. Yes. And where they used to keep the gods. Yes. The gods. Yes, I remember. And uh, she had the particular three gods. Yes, man of God. These were the demonic gods. Yes, man of God. And for her to run mad, it is because the brown god died. Since that time, phew, her things... Shoo, shoo. In the dream, you see the gods. Yes. What you have said, man of God, it's true. I always dream the gods and the brown god like... Yes. Three gods, go. Madness, go forever. <laughs> Sanedi from Germany being delivered right now. Jesus, we thank you for the matter has been settled. Okay. What is it? My name is Rosemary Tadenera from Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. Uh, men of God, I've come with my sisters. Uh, we don't get along. The home near the Vare? Yes, men of God. <laughs> My name is Felistas Maboya. I come from Harare, Zimbabwe. The home that you are talking about is my grandfather's house. It is near the valley, yes. My grandmother uh, divorced my grandfather. Then he, he took another wife. My grandfather used to throw stones. He used to spit. If, if you go into the bedroom that he used to sleep, there is saliva all over. Uh, a lot of drama was happening in that village. We were told that our uncles used to fight. Every Saturday they so would fight what is the other. question you ask? The question was, we are sisters, but we don't get along. Men of God, these two, they are the notorious two. Because, Me and this one. Because even this one, she first see in the dream, somebody come and slap her, fight her. What you said about the dream is true, man of God. There was a man who was always coming to fight for me. Even last week, he came and touched my two legs. Then I told my sister that someone is fighting me in the dream. Whenever that man come to fight you, you fight your husband, you fight everybody. Yes, man of God. I'm always fighting even with my husband. I'm not submissive. I can even slap him with the back of my hand. I don't respect anyone, man of God. Even my mother, I talk to her anyhow. Even my big sisters, I talk to them anyhow, man of God. I can even beat my children with whatever it is near me, man of God. She loves you too I much. Love you. I, love you. I, love you. Eh? 
Oh. I love you, but she doesn't believe that I love you, man of God. Tell you. She disrespects me, man of God. She is not the one doing that. Man of God. Look, look at her. She's even crying. Man of God. She thinks that I'm jealous of you, but I'm not. I always well, have a pretty life, man of God. You know, Jesus is intervening in the life of these sisters. Restoring their peace. Harmony. Abuna! You want to fight? Yes. Okay. I'll fight. So what? Well, okay, you stand here and fight. I want. Leave her. Wow! Why do you want me to go? Yeah, we are men. What brethren? Manifestation of the evil spirits. Where are you? I'm here. The demons are manifesting for their destruction. You fight. The battle between the kingdom of fight. darkness. I'm here. Fight. Fight. Of I'm here. Open your eyes. I'm here. <laughs> Was like Lord in Odia. Much less love and beauty, endless world. Nothing in this world. Nothing in this world. So today is your freedom. That man who come to fight you, I remove him now. Go, Abunayam! In the name of Jesus, never come back to her life. This lady from Zimbabwe receiving her deliverance right now. Look, he's moving. Watch the on the screen, brethren, see how the demons are parting from her. The fire of the Holy Ghost is consuming them. They are removing all their property. Uh. Watch, brethren. Whatever they deposited in her mouth, in the ears, in every part of her has got to part in the name of Jesus Christ. All the chains the devil had used to connect her to himself are being broken. This is being done in Jesus' mighty name. Clap for Jesus the winner man. The mighty deliverer. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm free. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. Let me deliver you people. Kapuna! Fire! You want to fight? What deliverance is going on with these sisters in Jesus' name? They are all from Zimbabwe. Come you! In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, they are children. Lord Jesus. I see you. Go. Demons have got to part from their lives. I just want you to bless me. I do a lot of ventures in mining, so... If I just want any you... man step into Christ Jesus, he is a new creation. It is over. Amen. No what it is over. Only what is um, the issue, your people had a mountain or a hill where they used to go for witches or witchcraft. Yeah, in our village, it's very prevalent. We are surrounded by mountains. And uh, one of our uncles is his altars there. He's blind so, now, he can see. So this is the issue now. You dream, you have gone to the mountain, you have gone to the mountain. So let me remove that journey to the mountain. The eh? He was telling me the dream yesterday. Hey. When, where he dreamed in the mountain. Thank you, Jesus. Saying you should leave the husband. I don't know if the husband is good for her because the husband took her to school. Is the one who was paying school fees for her. Now that she wants to 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 graduate, they are saying the husband is not good for you. So I'm asking. Who said? My two sisters said that the husband is not good for you. <laughs> Let me explain, men of God. The husband that they are talking about. We can't say he didn't pay anything. It's not her husband. It's. Her husband's brother, now her husband is no longer talking to the brother because they are in love. So I said, we will go to men of God, you will clarify the issue. Where is the problem? No, pen of weight. <laughs> no, men of God, we are just saying, since her husband is no longer speaking to... He doesn't love you. He does. Then what is the problem? Oh, they are saying what? No, the issue is now paying the dowry. Yes. Thank you, man of God. Paying the dowry. He's a good husband to you. They love each other. If you take him to school, do you have a degree? 
So I said, I will ask men of God. Exactly. Now, yes. let's pay the cows. Yes, thank you, men Office of God. Office give me $2,000, we pay the dowry. That's so. Yeah, eh? That's exactly what we wanted. We only wanted clarification from the men of God. Only yeah. that. Now we go to pay the dowry. You saw the child in the dream. Yes, men of God. And I was shown the baby with the hands and they said, this is your baby. Then I said, can I hold? They said, no, it's not the time. Take, take your baby. The office give me $2,000, you pay the dowry. Take to the husband, tell him that the man of God has contributed. We pay the cows. Uh, Mama, we're going to pay the dowry. Thank you, no, no problem. There are four kids. You asked for four? Yes, I asked for four. I was, huh? telling, I was telling my friend, babe. I was telling him. She asked me how many babies you want. He said four. Yeah? He said she wants four, and I said I want two. manifesting in the life of this lady. Lose your grip and go. Leave her. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, love the lover of, of my soul. soul. Jesus, I will never let you go. You've taken me. You've taken me. Upon the rock, now I know. Lord, I love you. I love you. I need you. I need you. Ooh. Though my world may fall, I'll never let you go. Jesus, lover of my soul. Say Jesus. Jesus, Lord, I will never let you go. Feet upon the rock. Now I know. This is where your audience, your problems came from. These are stones. My name is Diana Zwange. I am from Zimbabwe. 1996, one of my, he was actually a neighbor by the name Philip. He took me to a place where we passed through stones. But before he took me to that place, he said, can I please have your hair? Yeah, on my forehead and all my nails from my hands and from my foot. Then he said, I want you to walk going back home, but I don't want you to look back. And ever since that time, my life, I've had miscarriages. My fallopian tubes were removed. The place looked really like this. Thank and you, they made God. you to marry demon, which comes at night to Take That's you true, men of to God. sleep with you. Yes. And uh, take you back over there that you become witch doctor. Yes, men of God, I can confirm that to be true. There is a man who comes into my dreams. I remember the last time I went to, to a traditional function. So they started to play what we call Ngoma in Shona. Then I don't know what happened to me. I started rolling and shaking my body. So this is the spirit which has been disturbing you, wanting to kill you. You have thoughts of death. Deliver me, man of God. That is so true. Always think of dying. She doesn't know what she's doing. She doesn't know what is going on. She walks, loses. She's just there in the world. Why? That place of witchcraft. Man of God, I want to confirm that a lot of times I, I want to give up. Because I've tried, tried to work. Nothing is coming out. I try to have children. Never nothing. give up because Jesus has entered your life. You are now going to open up an orphanage. Many people will come to your orphanage, teach them how good Christ is, 
you have more than a thousand orphans. The European people, the people from everywhere will help you. You will stand taller. Amen. I receive the of God. Okay, take your blessing in Jesus' name. Special blessing has entered the life of Sister Diana from Zimbabwe. They are new every morning. New every morning. Great is thy faithfulness, O Lord. Great is thy faithfulness. My name is Rodness Mtambo from Malawi. Man of God, I want to help me. I'm so aggressive to my husband. The tall man is the one who married you. This was my boyfriend some time back. So you want to know why you are fighting your husband, Ababa, because of this boyfriend? <laughs> Maybe I made a mistake to get this man because he doesn't know what he's doing. Go and love your husband. Come be able to come in the mighty name of Jesus. Never out. Never is going for this sister from Malawi. Out. Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name. Mm. No, don't worry because you wanted too much to talk to me. Yes. Uh, because yes, the question was too bitter. Yeah. Man of God. You wanted to leave. You say, if I don't see this man of God, I'll just leave. Yes. My name is Tamandana Chumwe from Malawi, Mangochi. Mm. This is my mother-in-law. Mm. He has seven children. Mm -hmm. All children learn mad. When he was coming, my husband told me, he also, I want to learn mad. So, man of God, I want to know That is why I said the issue is too big that you wanted to leave the family. Of children, mother, seven. Should I leave the family? Should yes. I leave this marriage? This is too bad. If Kakande doesn't give me an answer, I'll just leave the family. Thank you. The answer is here. Don't cry. Yes. 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 All the children went mad. This is where my father came from. Who was doing this? She's, she's saying, yes, it's true, it's true. And she's saying the, the lady, she's saying the lady, she was doing that. It's true, it's true. Witchcraft. Yes, she's saying there's a lot of witchcraft from my dad's side. Mm. This is why her children are mad. Come on! Ah, out in the name of Jesus Christ. Have you seen the cause? Yes. Anybody is going on for these brethren? From Malawi. So I'll give you the anointing oil and the water and I'll let you know what to do. Don't worry, <laughs> everything will be okay. Happy Chilari, I'm from Malawi. Because of the house and uh, you people grew up being despised. Yes, man of God. 
spirit of rejection you people yes, man of god what you are if, talking is true if you live here where can you go you people what good thing can come out of you or two we then, are not counted we are just alone in our family it's just separated you dream you are walking in a dirty way you are seeing a sea ahead of you yes man of god sometimes i dream that uh, i'm walking going to the sea sometimes it's the dog chasing me then i find the sea ahead of me which i cannot cross there now i'm going to split the sea so that you can walk on uh huh sing for him you split the sea so i can walk right through it my fears are drowned in perfect love my fears are drowned in a perfect love so your fears today you had are going to be drowned yes in a perfect love in the name jesus christ my fears are drowned in perfect love oh because of this man you couldn't get peace Yes man of God the man the man of God is saying is my asper Where is him He's a drunkard and this is the biggest reason brought you here Yes so, man of God man of God what can I do should I leave the home no Yes man of God that is true Hey is, is the one Yes sir Yes man of God my, my name is Gladys Koske hmm. and this is my asper I have even tried to even leaving the home and when i want to go But i you... feel i love him yes me too i love him <laughs> because he is not himself yes man okay. this is a family issue this family is developing okay we shall know what to do our family we are trying very well there is a, a pilot there is an advocate but uh, uh, the ladies that they're not married the man who was to be an engineer he was very 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 clever the, the man of god what he was saying is true i wanted to be a, a building construction engineer yes but i divided to medical medical laboratory mm-hmm. then i wanted to be a policeman father set him free oh lord for the salvation of his soul He's not a bad man. Father, we thank you. We bless you, Holy Spirit. This brother from Kenya being set free from the spirit of drunkenness. God. It is all over. Thank you, man of God. But thank you, Jesus. Rise up. You must go back to your engineership. Now we are going to change a bit. Eh? Uh, instead of being this uh, building engineers that one it would let us we are going to be mechanical engineer i thank you man of god for so the office Lord. give me 100 kenya shillings kakande minister will pay for you all the school fees <laughs> and see when you finish the studies we will give you some allowance for study for two years yes so now after that you work for one year to a certain garage this is uh, that indian man is halfway indian halfway whatever after that you open up your big garage it means three years from now you'll be one of the biggest mechanics in kenya Uh, repairing this matatu you know matatu many buses whatever da da you know, da, 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 da. Uh, one of the biggest thank you jesus my thank fears you, are drawn in perfect love take kakande as your father don't worry so this is 100 we start yes thank you. now my daughter is very happy You you can now I'm have up, have your peace. Up, man of God, thank you Lord. You can now have your peace. Thank you. Thank you man of Tell God. Tell him I love you. Judy 
The woman said, not here. Not here. I don't be married here. Man of God, what you said, the time I was getting married, there was my auntie from my mother's side saying that I won't get married. The mm. husband has troubled himself to do this, to do that, mm -hmm. but things are not coming. Proper. What you've said is true, man of God. <laughs> Father, thank you. Bless your holy name. Thank you for putting light in their marriage, in their family, in Jesus' name. Go and prosper. What is it? The three days issue. My name is Christine Zioka from Kenya. Once upon a time, everything was going on well. But the three days issue. You people went for three days. Man of God, what you said is true. There was a time I was getting sick and I was taken to a witch doctor for three days. That's what I said, the three days issue. The sickness was not all that big. It was the stomach issue. I confirm the prophecy. It needed not to go to a witch doctor. Even a hospital would have cured this, but you went to a witch doctor. Since that time, money and everything, nothing. That is what devastated your family. After that time, we have so many dates. Auctioneers are all over in our business. Our businesses are collapsing. You collected witchcraft powers from Satan. Abunaya Kabu, no, no. Sister Christian receiving her deliverance. All demonic power, go. Come out, devil, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Lose your grip. Leave her stomach. Come out! Fire on you! Go! Brethren, Sister Christine from Kenya receiving her deliverance right now. Where is Isabella? A man of God, uh, you asked me about Isabella. Isabella is my young sister. She's been married for 15 years without a kid, a baby. And she has a terminal disease called lupus. Can you bring her by next week? Yes, I can bring her. Office, give me 100,000 to bring Isabel. <laughs> That's why I asked you, where is she? Because she's suffering too much. She wanted to come three months ago, but she couldn't get money. Bring. I confirm the prophecy is true, man of God. Don't worry. Everything will. Thank you, man of God. My name is Amiri Sakala. I'm from Zambia. In my family, there's so much stagnation. I can't have a child. I have fibroids in my uterus. Come, I pray for you. This is Amiri Sakala receiving her deliverance. Your name is so great. Oh, even if they are two, you said even if they are two. Yes, man of God, God yes. Give me child, even if they are yes, two. Yes, yes, man of now God. Open your mouth. One, two. Oh, oh. Thank you, Jesus. Father, thank you for the two children. Rise up. But the family had another family and the neighborhood. The people sometimes when there was no money, no nothing to eat, the people used to go and eat over there. Yes. <laughs> yes, man of God, what you're saying is the truth. <laughs> Nobody thought that this would devastate the, the family. As having, uh, eating food from my neighbor's place, it's true. Uh, before we could eat from my neighbor's place, uh, we had my mom's younger sister. We could eat from her place, and then she stopped us from eating her place. So the only place we could eat food from was my neighbor's place. So I confirmed the prophecy to be true, man of God. So because of that, your family 
whatever blessing could now be channeled to flow over there because they were the one responsible for feeding you. Now we need to retrieve the blessing to you and you happen to help your family. May the blessing come upon your life. Go and feed your family. My name is Charula. I'm from Zambia, Lusaka. Man of God, I want to ask why a lot of premature death in my family. We were 12, we have remained the three of us, and no marriages, because, nothing. Because of this home, at a given time, water used to come when it rains. <laughs> Your name is so great. How wonderful is your name. Your name is so great. How wonderful is your name. Your name is so great. Once upon a time, there was a home. This home, here there was a road, and the water used to come a lot from up. Usually it wanted even to take the place. But down the place was a valley or a whatever where the water used to go. Go and call your mom. Because we are not here to guess. We are here to know the truth. Yes. Isn't it? Man of God, the prophecy is very true. I've just called my uncle. He has confirmed to be very true that he, the house you showed me was his grandfather's house. And the waters was just passing from the same house. Sometimes the house used to get full and they would sleep outside. Hallelujah. It's very true. So the prophecy will not just talk, hey, my neighbor is my enemy. Ah, ah. It can be your enemy in error. So the prophecy will go to the cause. My name is Mason Tambo. I come from Zambia. Man of God, I would like to know because my family, all my brothers, they are drunkard and have been married for 11 years without a child. Of God, please shed more light. Once upon a time, there was an old man. This is a man, not a woman. This is a trouser. This man was a bit tall, and this man lived at this place in the village. Because of what happened to him, this is the same blood. People are suffering with marry, remarry, whatever, all this problem. Why don't you call your people and ask them? This should be one of the grandfather issues. My name is Mesim Tambo. I'm coming from Zambia. Man of God, I've come to confirm the prophets. I have called my father, and my father he has explained that he, the prophet is true. That house, my grandfather used to live there. The tall man is my grandfather. About the troublesome, yes, he used to be a drunkard. When he drank, he used to beat my grandmother, and he used to insult the neighbors. Yes. And the marriage to wives. My, grand, my grandmother is the second wife. Yes, and they divorced. About the remarrying, all, all my uncles, they have remarried. My sister was divorced two years ago. Hallelujah. And they worship the idols. Even when, he, when, even when he died, they called all his children to cut his tongue. And they throw that tongue into the liver. Yes. 
The Holy Spirit so man not, of God, what you said is true. The Please, Spirit man of God, help. We will not just go. No, we will go right to the cause. So this is the issue in the family, and we need to eradicate all oh, whatever is going on, and even with your husband, everything to be peaceful. Yes, Father, with this holy water, let there be peace. The is going on for this couple from Zambia. Father, let there be peace in their family. Father, let there be peace in their family. In Jesus, hold it. You are free. Thank you, Jesus.